time again, time to meet our tail wagger of the week. And with us from Animal Humane is Laura and Sally. <laughs> Laura, tell us a little bit about Sally. Well, Sally, as you can tell, is really a tail wagger. She yes. is having such a great time here today. She's about a year and a half old. She is an American Pitbull cross. And she's been with us since about March. We transferred her from Gallup through our Project Fetch program. She's super calm for, for her age, mm -hmm. but she's so lovable. Um, she's got great leash manners. She actually knows sit already. I don't know if she'll do it for me right now because she seems to be yeah. very she affectionate. She is focused. She's like, the camera's on me. <laughs> she's like, I and, look um, good. <laughs> and she has the cutest little squeal when she yawns. Really? She's such a great dog. Aww. She's, she's going to make a great home mm -hmm. or have a great make a great pet for really any home. Yeah, and very lovey too. Just when very. I walked up to her meeting her for the first right. time, she was licking and just mm -hmm. wanted to be pet. So I know Sally, look at her, just kind of hanging out. She is, she's perfect. She's, she's like, like, I can like do this star. all day. <laughs> <laughs> so Laura, tell us about the adoption special you guys have going on this weekend. Sure, so this weekend, um, obviously it's the beginning of spring, mm -hmm. which is actually um, one of the, the beginning of the highest risk time for pets to contract heartworm disease. Okay. So we had a really generous donation of heartworm preventive medication from the Danza clinic and um, this weekend Friday Saturday and Sunday we are giving every dog adopted a three-month supply of heartworm medication Wow this okay. is something that you should keep your pet on all year yeah. um, and and they've been on it as in the shelter they've been tested so you know Sally is heartworm negative mm -hmm. but it's actually something that is becoming more common here in New Mexico yeah. and a lot of people don't think it's a problem Mm -hmm. Oops, there's that, there's that <laughs> She's tail. like backing up. <laughs> um, yeah, and especially like you said, we're going with spring right. and with the recent rains too. It's going to be a wet spring. There are going to be a lot of mosquitoes mm -hmm. everywhere. That's how it's transmitted. So all it takes is one bite. Yeah. Uh, so what we do is we we put um, a pet on on heartworm prevention for an entire year. It's basically one pill a month. Okay. And the cost of that is probably um, anywhere from maybe seventy five to one fifty for the entire year. It depends okay. on the weight of your dog. Yeah. But many people don't do it, so mm -hmm. the expense when your dog is heartworm positive is, is very high, and it's a very yeah. serious disease. It yeah. can be fatal. Is it something, so is it something you can cure if they do? It is treatable. Okay. Um, for pets that have maybe mild symptoms uh -huh. or are in the early stages, it's much more successful. For more developed cases, basically what heartworms do is they interfere with blood flow and the heart. Oof. So yeah, it can be good. very serious. There that. can be complications, mm -hmm. and it's a very expensive treatment. It's anywhere from $1,500 to $3,000 um, because there's a lot of hospitalization involved, and it's just not good. Okay, yeah. yeah. No, and we, we want to keep everyone Absolutely. healthy. And like you said, every every dog's susceptible. Right. This isn't like it just picks on breeds. So. Every dog, even here in New Mexico. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The the events this weekend, mm -hmm. you said? That's right, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Oh, my gosh. And what uh, location is that at? We're actually offering them at all of our locations. Oh, so we have the um, main okay. campus at 615 Virginia yeah. Street Southeast and then our Northeast Heights Adoption and Training Center at uh, on Montgomery Boulevard. Okay, and if there was someone at home interested in Sally, where is she going to be? She's going to be at our main campus in our Big Blue Adoptions building. Okay, and you said, too, we still need cat videos. We correct? still need cat videos. We're still, it's still early. And <laughs> For so the I know event. We're going to yes. get lots of cat. We've gotten some great ones so far. Someone's actually emailed me to see if they could send them an animated video. There you but, go. But um, that competition runs through May 15th, and okay. then the Internet Cat Video Festival is in late June, the 26th and 27th. Perfect. So all you got to do is take a video of your cat mm -hmm. doing something funny. Something cute. <laughs> send it to you guys but that's right very good well Sally you did great today for more information on Sally or the adoption event that they have with the heartworm special that you guys are doing that's this weekend you can go to our website carekiwi.com we'll be right back <laughs>